morning, class. Where are the rest of you? I thought I saw all of you guys getting off the bus together. You know, I'm sick and tired of this tardiness and late. <laughs> Quietly. Silence. You three, thanks so much for joining us today. Shmuley, what's the excuse today? Scarfy choked on a meatball, so we take him to the ER. And... Enough of these excuses. Enough of them. Every day I hear another one of you, and it makes no sense. Everyone, please open up your gemaras. <sighs> Beitz Ashnod of a Shabbos. An egg that was born on Shabbos. I mean, egg isn't born. It's kind of late. Yes? What if it's a rooster, not a hen? What happens then? Yes? What if it lays a hard boiled egg? What happens then? Class! Rabbi! You know, guys, this attitude is not getting me anywhere. Nowhere. <sighs> no, nope. I just marked your missionaries tests. And frankly, I'm pretty disappointed. Inko, come over here and do our test.
That was you? Yes, sir, it was. You did it! You of all students! You glued me to my chair! How did you do such a thing? I'm sorry. I'm sorry? I'm sorry! Get out of my class, I'm sorry! I don't want to see you step a foot in here until your father and mother have a meeting with the principal! And by the way, don't forget to write 10,000 times I'll never ever make trouble in class and I'll always be a good kid and never disturb my teacher. Hello. Hello, Mr. Metzger. Speaking. This is Rabbi Barris from your son's yeshiva. I just want to inform you that David glued his teacher to his chair. He glued his teacher down to the chair. Speaking about David Metzger here? Yes, it's out of character. Yes, we know his, his uh, record. He has a track record. One of our best students. I understand that. That's why I'm just sending him home to kind of cool off a little bit, and you'll have a good talk with him, and uh, a message him tomorrow. We'll start a fresh new day, and you'll send him to Yeshiva. All right, sorry to call you about it, but uh, it's very unusual, but see what happens tomorrow. Okay, thank you. Have a nice day.